A diagnosis of cancer is devastating and life-changing. Moving forward with the new Welch Cancer Center will enable us to help patients and their families remain in Sheridan for comprehensive, compassionate care together at home. The hospital has provided radiation treatment since 1991. Dr. Stamato arrived in 1996 and brought with him his innovative ideas and passion for treating cancer patients. Radiation was uh, the main kicker for mine because mine started in the, in the bone marrow and the radiation could get it in the bone marrow. So uh, they had a great radiation. Instead of going to the Billings, uh, they had a fabulous radiation thing over at the Wells Cancer Center and Dr. Stamato. And uh, so he took the immediate care of my most dangerous stuff. And we were trying to find a place where he could have infusions without driving to Billings every two weeks or once a month. So the Welch Cancer Center agreed to take Cade and give him his infusions. The Welch Cancer Center has consistently been committed to the highest standard of care and provides a level of technology and equipment that can compare with much larger facilities. I was diagnosed in South Africa and went through most of my treatment in South Africa. It was just the tail end of my treatment that I needed the infusion here, and so had to have it done here, which was turned out to be fantastic. I was diagnosed with breast cancer in May, and um, about six weeks before my wedding. It was a lot, um, a lot more personable than I expected, and so on a you know a one to ten scale, I'd probably give him a, a nine, you know, and I would give him a ten if we had a little bit bigger facilities and a little more comfortable. If they had it twice as, twice that size, they could get twice as many people in and do that much more work. Because I guarantee you, a lot of people are going to Cody and they're going to, they're going to Billings. The current cancer center was originally a residence and has been remodeled over the years into a patient care facility. The new cancer center will provide a healing, spacious, patient-centered, non-clinical environment for patients to receive treatments. The Welch Cancer Center, uh, of course, being a part of the hospital, uh, is something very important to us and through the foundation we hope to raise uh, some funds to make sure that we have the cancer services available to our community. They spend a lot of time with us at the Welch. If they are coming for chemotherapy they can spend anywhere from two hours to eight hours. Uh, radiation is a little bit quicker but then they're there every day. So a lot of their life is with us. The process of de designing the project has been done with a lot of stakeholders. We've done it with the doctors, the nurses, um, patients, and, um, and the hospital staff to create a building that's going to be efficient and, um, and comfortable. It's not going to feel like an institution. It's going to feel homey. Through our strategic planning process, our meetings with physicians and with the community, we feel that the time is now for comprehensive cancer care close to home and uh, we feel that uh, the expansion of the Welch Cancer Center uh, is going to answer that for a lot of people. So children don't have to go halfway around the world just to get one infusion? Our cancer center touches the lives of people you know. Your family, friends, neighbors, and co-workers. Your help is needed to keep our cancer patients in Sheridan, getting the quality treatment they need in their hometown. The time is now for comprehensive, personalized cancer care here in Sheridan. Help us all stay together at home.